Novak Djokovic got away with breaking the strict dress code at Wimbledon. Novak Djokovic surprised the center court crowd when he turned up for the second day of Wimbledon with Gray strapping on his knee, clashing with the all-white dress code associated with the Summer Slam. However, the seven-time SW19 champion explained that he had been given permission from the tournament's higher-ups and had sought out a white version of the padding, but had to walk out wearing the closest possible version he could find. But with Scottish wildcard Jacob Fernley up next, likely to be on the main stage once again on Thursday, Djokovic did say that he told the Wimbledon brass that he would do his best to don white strapping after pointing out a more flagrant infringement by Francis Tiafo. I did check, Djokovic explained when queried about his choice of outfit. I actually just met the chairwoman just before walking onto the court. She gave me the thumbs up so it was okay. Of course, we did check in the days prior if we have permission. We're trying to find a white one, trust me. I saw Francis Tiafo played, he actually had a black color sleeve. Gray, I think it's maybe slightly better towards the white. Yeah, I know it's not ideal. I like to go all white and I like to respect the rules. But I got the permission. I said to them that I will give our best for the next match the white one. The Wimbledon rulebook states that Competitors must be dressed in suitable tennis attire that is almost entirely white, which includes shoes and undergarments, with an exception provided for female players who are allowed to wear solid mid-dark colored undershorts, provided they are no longer than their shorts or skirt. The regulation also extends to medical supports and equipment, such as Djokovic's knee strapping, though the rules are slightly more relaxed and state that they should be white if possible, but may be colored if absolutely necessary.